Hey guys, it's Ashley from my simply curvy life that blogspot.com. I'm here, you know, it's kind of been a while and I'm motivated to blog again, like woo, finally. Um, I wanted to start off with a tag, like it's Wednesday. Well, it's Wednesday when we're recording this. Hopefully, it's going to be Wednesday when I post this. Mm -hmm. Depends on how the editing goes. Um, I'm here with one of my best friends, Danielle, and I thought it would be cool to do the plus size or big girl challenge, thick madame challenge. I don't know, whatever you want to call it. Um, I was called out a while ago, so now I think it's the right time to, you know, do the challenge. So, say hey, Danielle. Hey. How y'all doing? <laughs> um... So it's just we're just going to answer these questions. I'm going to be looking down at my phone. So I'm not being rude. I'm not texting. I'm just trying to get the questions. All right. So question number one. What do you classify yourself as? Curvy, fat, thick, plus size, heavy, ample, whatever. Mm, probably thick. Thick? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, I would say plus size sometimes. Mm -hmm. Like... I don't know. I guess it depends on who I'm talking to. Mm -hmm. Because, well, let me stop saying this. I do not like being called a big girl. Like, I hate being... Do not call me a mm. big girl. Don't, I don't like the word fat. I, I would never use the word fat to describe myself. And I don't think other big girls should either. Um, so, yeah. Pro plus size, maybe thick. Plus size. Curvy. Yeah. But not fat. I don't even like the P-H-A-T. Like, For real? No. Pretty hot and thick? No. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. I don't mind. I don't mind fat. Like I said, it just depends on who I'm talking to. Mm -hmm. You know, because everybody means it in a different way when they're talking to you. So, mm -hmm. yeah, you know what? That might be a, a topic for another day because mm -hmm. you know there's some things I want to say. Like especially on Instagram mm -hmm. and people putting up stuff like, "Oh, you consider this curvy and this isn't curvy." I am mm -hmm. curvy and I am thick, mm -hmm. and there's no standards on what that is. Mm -hmm. But anyway, I'm about to get along with it. Um, what's your body shape? Are you hourglass, spoon, rectangle, triangle, pear, apple? Apple. Apple? Yes, apple. Oh. But, because I, I don't know, I gain weight in this area mm -hmm. and nowhere else. So, apple. Apple. Mm -hmm. I think I'm kind of apple pearish. Like, I think I'm a little bit of both. Like, oh. apple pearish. Um, third question is going along. Are you comfortable or happy at your current size? I'm comfortable. Um, right now, my goal is to lose like 50 pounds, but nothing more, nothing less. I enjoy being a plus size woman. Um, I've been plus size all my life. I don't ever see myself being like 120 pounds. Um, so yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm comfortable with my weight right now. Mm, I'm comfortable and I'm happy because I'm confident. You know what mm -hmm. I'm saying? Like that's just who I am. But I would like to lose a couple pounds. Mm -hmm. You know. It never mm -hmm. hurts. And it's not even just to be skinny, but I think some things that I want to wear, mm -hmm. I would look better in them if I was to lose weight. Right. Yeah. Um. So give your... Oh, I think I skipped too much. Oh. Well, we kind of answered this already, mm -hmm. but would you like to lose weight and if so, how much? Just 50 pounds. Kinda always say That's weight. it. Mm -hmm. Um. I would say 50 to 100. Right. right. Yeah. And, I mean, that's a long-term goal. Like, I'm not... About to be like lose a hundred pounds in the next month. Mm -mm. No, but just if I could lose weight or if I did lose weight, it'd be fifty. Just fifty. Yeah. To a hundred. Something like that. Um what is a fat thing that you do and think is funny? Um, I guess it gives examples like breathe heavy, sweat, something like that. Well, I don't think that stuff is funny. But okay. So a fat thing <laughs> that I do, um, and this is so weird. I put ice on my cereal, you guys. Yeah. Fat thing. Yeah, yeah. I think that's pretty. Just to keep the milk cold, because I feel like if the milk is not, it got to be a certain temperature, like. Oh, no, I'm with you. Listen, her and it. her sister are my best friends, and they taught me to put the ice in the cereal. It keeps like, the milk cold. It keeps it cold. It and keeps I don't like cold. hot milk. I barely even like milk. But right. I, it got to be cold. Right. And they told me to put ice in it. And at first, I thought it was the weirdest thing I ever seen, mm -hmm. but. Yeah, it has to be 2% though because it gets cold quicker. No, girl, you gotta try silk. Silk, silk is like that. Right. Silk, silk right. is the bomb. I'm about to get hit by everybody. Unsweetened silk, vanilla. Mm -hmm. Well, wait a minute. We're not doing no shout out to no brands. Mm -mm. <laughs> um, so, a, a, a thing that I do is fat and I think it's funny. Um, I don't know. I can tell you something that happened to me 
of day, that thought was funny. And I think just about, like, because you're bigger, you walk kind of harder. Um, and I have these platform, like, little gladiator, gladiator sandals. Mm -hmm. And I broke them today. Because I think I was walking so hard. And, like, the whole bottom kept, and they probably was cheap, too. But the whole bottom mm -hmm. came off, and I was week and i'm just so glad it happened <laughs> when i was going back home and mm -hmm. not going to my destination oh <laughs> um what is your plus size pet peeve plus size pet peeve like as it relates to all women i guess um plus size pet peeve uh eating sloppy in restaurants yes okay. that's a pet peeve of mine i mean because it's like we're already plus size it's like you know there's nothing wrong with chewing your food with your mouth closed and, you know, getting one plate at a time. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Shade. <laughs> <laughs> shady boots. She is shady boots, y'all. <laughs> um, I don't know. My plus size pet peeve. I think... I don't know. I, I think it's so many. Mm. Like, my plus size pet peeve. Like, my number one thing... A peppy with my, I just hate how fat girls are like overly fat. Um, hold on, let me let me let me fix that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> let me fix that. Let me fat. <laughs> but overly fat, as in when we're when we're outside or like in public, mm -hmm. uh, except for the ones who are genuinely confident with themselves and who carry themselves well. Mm -hmm. But sometimes. Um, Plus size women, we do too much. Mm -hmm. You know, we got to be the loud one or mm -hmm. we always got to be mm -hmm. goofy, you know. Just got to be loud no matter where. And it's like, you know, because I'm big, I feel like people see me anyway because I see them see me. Mm -hmm. So I don't have to come in and make myself known. Like, I don't have to come in and be loud and be ghetto and mm -hmm. just be extra just because I'm fat to try to make myself fit in. So I think that's my pet peeve. Just <sighs> big girls who do too much. Mm -hmm. Like, girl, relax. Like, chill out with really. Um, okay, so last question. Um, give us a plus size tip, like example, deodorant and the creases, angle in the camera when you're taking pictures, blah 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 blah. Um, a plus size tip. Let me see. Um, Oh, well, no, that's not really a tip because I think all the naturals miss their hair before they do anything or before they leave. Um, I don't know. I really don't know. That's it. So I guess your tip would be just when you step out the door and get it right, get it tight, make sure everything is together. Mm -hmm. that's right. Right, that's it. Yeah. And make sure your shoes are really tight. Don't trip. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> oh, she is so stupid. She's silly. Uh -oh. um, I think that's it, really. Okay, so my tip would be, I guess to tie it into the last one, like, just be comfortable in yourself and, like, don't don't live up or live down to certain stereotypes just because you are a big girl. And just because it zips, that doesn't mean that it fits. That's right. And that is my number one thing because mm -hmm. you have these plus-size women out here who just think it fits mm -hmm. and zip, uh, think it because zips, it fits. And girl, mm -hmm. it do not. And we be out here looking a mess. Mm -hmm. And we have options, big girl. I'm sorry, I got more than one. Yes. More than one tip. Because we have options. So it's no reason why we out here looking a mess mm -hmm. and we don't have to. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. And that was a free honey shade boot. Mm -hmm. It's like, I'm playing. Yes, girl. <laughs> <laughs> I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm joking. <laughs> so... This was fun. It, really it was, was fun. Weird. Thank you, Danielle. Thank you so much we'll for doing the video for me. We should tag somebody else. Mm -hmm. Let's tag Terry. Terry. My friend Terry. She's yes. plus half. Yes. Um, who do I like right now? Aaliyah. Yes. Uh, from Jersey. Virginia State. Yes. Tag. Tag. Okay. Tag. tag. Aaliyah. Mm -hmm. You got her Instagram? Because we're going to be good. Mm -hmm. At Aaliyah G, I think. With okay. bad E's at the end. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, so Aaliyah and Terry, we're going to be looking out for you guys' this video because you're two of our favorite, favorite, mm -hmm. favorite plus size friends. Again, mm -hmm. thank you, Danielle. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe and keep in contact with me on the blog, on my Instagram, on my Twitter. I don't really tweet like that, but on Twitter mm -hmm. and Google Plus. Mm -hmm. I'm going to leave all of that in the description. Don't forget to subscribe and like. Talk to you guys next time. Peace.